It's a new week and that means it's time for new releases. Mary is swamped this week so it looks like you're stuck with me. If you manage to snag an early pre-order of the Oculus Rift, then you'll finally be able to step into the future of gaming. The Valkyrie and Lucky's Tale will come packaged with the headset, but if the headset didn't break the bank, here's some other games you can pick up for your new toy. Adrift, Adventure Time Magic Man's Head Games, Blaze Rush, Kronos, Dead Secret, Eve Gunjack, Fly to Kuma, Keep Talking and Nobody Explodes, Radio G, Smashing the Battle, and Winlands. The Oculus Rift and all these games will come out on March 28th. For those of us who are either too broke or don't have a strong enough allegiance to the PC Master Race, there's still plenty of games coming out this week. First, MLB The Show swings its way on the PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 3 this week. This year adds Showtime Mode, which lets you slow down time and interact with plays that might normally seem mundane. An improved Road to the Show mode that offers a far more personalized experience, and a Conquest mode where you travel across North America earning fans and holding territories with the power of America's favorite pastime. You can step up to bat on March 29th. But if you don't own a PlayStation and you still want to take a visit to a virtual ballpark, you're in luck because RBI Baseball 2016 comes out March 29th. While you're waiting for Resident Evil 4 to re-release on current gen consoles, you can replay the not so great Resident Evil 6. I hope you're not sick of killing zombies and grotesque monsters as Leon Kennedy, Chris Redfield, and Jake Muller, you know, the guy with his head shave that no one really cares about. The game features three different interconnected campaigns, all of which can be played cooperatively, and you can get that on the 29th. If adventure games are more your thing, you can pick up Episode 5 of Minecraft Story Mode and Episode 2 of The Walking Dead Michonne. Episode 5 is called Order Up and it will bridge the gap between the first season and the next three episodes which were recently announced. Give Me No Shelter, the second of three episodes for The Walking Dead Michonne, will launch the same day. You can download both of these on the 29th. Killer Instinct also kicks off Season 3 on the 29th. Eight new and returning fighters will be released over the course of the next few months, including everyone's favorite Battletoad Rash and the Arbiter from Halo. Rash, the Arbiter, Kim Wu, and Tusk will be available right off the bat. There are three different versions of Season 3 that you might want to know about. A $20 Combo Breaker Edition, a $40 Ultra Edition, and a $60 Supreme Edition. But just to be clear, all three of these versions include access to all eight characters once they launch. Finally, the game I'm most excited for this week is Hyper Light Drifter. The game will release on March 31st for Windows and Mac, and unfortunately, you're gonna have to wait a little bit longer for it to come to consoles. Hyper Light Drifter is a colorful, dreamlike, top-down RPG in the vein of classic 16-bit games. You play as a drifter, a collector of forgotten knowledge, searching for a cure to a vicious disease. And that's just about it for this week. Let me know which game you're looking forward to, and remember, these dates are based on publisher listings and are subject to change.